we were upset because we weren't running the football the way we wanted it to. So we had a few options, you know, either be upset and just sit there and dwell on the misery or fix it. So we, we kept getting in the film room. We would have, you know, O-line meetings and stuff with Coach Dickey. And then we'd also have ones with outside extra hours and we'd do them by ourselves and put in extra film study and extra time because it's something that's important to us. We wanted to run the football. Um, so with that extra time and, you know, extra Putting in, putting in the extra time where needed, we were able to make some adjustments and make some fixes and got things turned around these last few games. You hear people say all the time, uh, you know, I'm the luckiest guy, I've got the best job ever. But for me to be at the school I played at, where I've raised three kids, they've all gone through the same school system. And when I go around town, you know, everywhere in the country now, coast to coast, people recognize, you know, and they'll say that guy, there's a the guy from Oklahoma State. That's something that's been built over a long period of time with guys like you. And it just happened, ironically, that this game today was a great example of a bunch of tough guys that just said, we're going to do whatever it takes. And you got on the sideline, you made adjustments, and your coaches did a good job making adjustments also throughout the game. So I'm very proud um, to be at Oklahoma State, and I'm very proud to be your coach.